Hello, this is Easter 2020. I'm Julian from polio24.de from Munich and um, I'm happy to show you today my favorite top 10 watches. Um, these are the actual top 10 watches. Um, I was asked by a um, customer from Paris which watch I'm preferring and this really changes very fast and very often but I am happy to show you today my actual top 10s and um, I'm sure it is a little bit difficult at the moment for many of you and you have to stay, many of you have to stay at home and uh, so maybe this is a little small distraction for you. We are very happy to work uh, every day and to send watches to you if you order them and um, or you just surf on my shop and check out the videos and the lots of watches. But now I show you my top 10 for today. So these are 10 of my favorites, um, actual favorites. I have five new and five vintage watches. So <clears throat> let's start. This is a Vostok manual winding watch of the 80s. Um, I like it because it's very robust, it's watertight and uh, like all uh, the Vostok watches, it really um, runs, runs and runs without any problems. Then I have the Poliot Imperator Zar Nikolai chronograph from the 90s. Um, I like it because of the very uh, special uh, design and um, the Russian Cyrillic signature on the lunette. It's a very special watch indeed. Then I have the Patek Philippe. No, it's I'm kidding. It's the Vostok, but it looks a little bit like a Patek in my opinion. A very decent watch of the um, 60s. And then I have something special. Uh, it's a Poliot column wheel chronograph. Many of you might know this type of watch. It's from the late 60s or and 70s. It's very rare nowadays and the prices are crazy. Um, this is a very decent uh, chronograph. And then I have the Slava Tonneau watch or square watch. Um, it just has a very special 70s design. That's why I like it. Um, and then to the new watches. For sure, one of my all time favorites is the Okean chronograph one of the Russian watches with the most history and um, very unique design with the Polio 3133 caliber inside. Then I have a rather new model. It's the Strela 40 millimeter. This is the tribute model. I like it because it's quite similar to the column wheel chronograph but I rather not wear the column wheel chronograph too often because it's so precious. So I wear for everyday use the new Strela. Then for sure the um, Siegel 1963 acrylic chronograph. This one um, fits with brown strap very well in my opinion. And um, I have uh, the sapphire and the acrylic versions in my collection and I change them from time to time. And I also wear the 42 millimeter version very often with the, with the incel leather strap. It's a very nice new Rios leather strap. And um, this has the sapphire crystal. And um, it has 42 millimeter and I have a rather normal wrist, but it's still comfortable to wear. And then I have the uh, new Alexander Shorokov 63 automatic. I always like the style of Alexander Shorokov and this unique design. And nobody else has these watches. Uh, if you have such a watch, they are really rare, handcrafted with a beautiful decorated caliber. So for today, these are my special watches. And if you want a review of a Russian watch you have in mind or something, just let me know in your comments if I can do something for you. Okay, have a nice time.